Hello ladies and gentlemen, I'm the Marmoset, and welcome to Minecraft. Yes, Minecraft, because sometimes you just have to go back to your roots. So I've not played this for a while, that takes off. Alright, I've got the subtitles on, so that's what that one does. Um, block. That's, that's a good start, that's a nice grey block. Um, let's turn around. Ah, okay, we're in. Alright, so there's terrain over there, that looks nice and high. Llama steps. Bleats and pops. Lava. Alright, so there's llama nearby. And there's lava nearby. Right, I'm going to turn subtitles off because that's a bit weird. Um, so we've already got pumpkins. In fact, there's a jack o' lantern over there. I see. Yep, yeah, yep. That's the llama bleating. All right. Um, there's some coal. First thing you need to do is punch a tree and get some wood. Ah, there's a whole load of llamas, including one that's already apparently to its death. So we did hear a lava pop sound effect, so it does kind of imply that there is some kind of cave or lava based instrument nearby, which we'll worry about later. Alright, so I don't know, this actual patch of ground I'm stood on directly right now seems like a decent place to start. Oh, I see chicken. So, with that in mind, let's get going. It has been many a year since I've played this game, so forgive me if I am. Um, Absorbently rusty. The first thing we can do is punch a tree. Let's see ferns. Can I gather these? No, just punch them. Oh, shrooms. Can you eat these? Apparently not just yet. <laughs> Can't eat a raw mushroom. Or at least I haven't figured out how you eat a raw mushroom yet. Flower! Yes, alright. Pumpkin? No, right. pumpkin. Can I eat that? That's placing. What that's doing. How do I. Inventory! Alright, so right click and splits. That shift can do it. Apparently, I immediately put one on my head. That makes sense. Let's knock this tree down. Achievement! Getting wood. Alright, so. Let's see, 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 see. Whoops. Oh, I jumped off my plane. There we go. Alright, wood punching time. Oh, plenty of time. Sounds like I know for a while. Yeah, I know, I just knocked those out. I want to get rid of the entry entirety of the tree. Don't want to waste any wood. Alright, you stay up there and gradually defoliate. And now we should build ourselves a crafting table. Going on over the mongoose. Alright. So, inventory. I want one of those. Put that over there. Oh, I see shields. Crafting table. Thank you. And you can benchmarking. Alright. I'll give you digging a hole over there. You. To be completely converted. Stick some of those that there gives me a shovel. No, give me a sword just to start off with. And I also want nope, a hoe, not bad. Pickaxe, that's what I really want. Um, I don't know what the recipe for shield is yet, we'll look that up later. In the interim, I think I will take all of that back, but I've got the core ingredients that I want, which is mostly those ones. I think I will probably make myself some more sticks for later, but in the interim, I can now vaguely defend myself. Um, that's an axe, that's the one I need. 
that, that, and that, and then uh, there, and there. Let's put you there. The water of immediate usefulness. So, one axe. There. That's a lot quicker, isn't it? Okay, I'm not going to go and alarm a killing spree immediately, but I will grab. Oh, I see squids. Start hacking some of this coal out. So I can make torches. Let's illuminate my first little house. Very tiny house. Hey, experience orbs. Orbs of experience! Make the jingly happy bouncy noise. Yes, I know. I'm going to burn this pickaxe out. I might as well. I was just to throw it away and leave it loiter. Dirt. Would you like to dirt? At some point, I'm going to worry about how I'm going to get some food. Right, that's an amount of gold to get started with. Now, let's go find ourselves a cliff face within which I can dig a reasonably secure and or safe hole. Ooh, some more coal. Everybody likes coal. Well, I do. I use it to make torches and smelt things. That was a llama noise. That's a really strange noise. I wonder if they actually got and found a llama and recorded the llama. It would make sense that they went and actually record that's a llama spitting. I don't want to get too close to a llama spitting. I have no idea how much damage a llama spit does. Spit, spit, spit goes the llama. Come on, faster. Well, there's a lot more coal in the seam than I was originally thinking. I've forgotten how many seams, you can, seams of coal you can get. Come on. Well, looks like we might be using this pickaxe up. Pick at, wouldn't pick axe up quite quickly then. Really? Still going? It's a double seam? Oh, I don't want a nice amount of coal to start off with. Looks like that's what I'm getting. Huge chunk of coal. It's still going. The sound of llama spitting. And other strange llama noises. Let's at least make sure I can get back out reasonably easily. Will you end? Will you end cold seams? Much like no home or cold. Keeps going and going and going and going and going. At last. Let's just burn this pickaxe out then. Should make an amusing noise when it does. There we go. Alright, let's put you down. Stick, stick. Rock, rock, rock. Our first stone tool. Huzzah. Uh, two axe. Take. I'm assuming that little combat symbol. Oh, there must be some sort of power bar. Hello, llama. Yes, hello, llama spittings. I'm pretty sure it's not enough power. It, the subtitle said llama. So I'm going to trust that's what it is. Yeah, no more coal. No, not more coal. I can't stand the thought of more coal. Oh, I see an egg. I see several eggs, thanks to the chickens. You have not laid an egg. You have not laid an egg. There's another egg over there. Two-dimensional egg. Two-dimensional eggs are the best kind of egg. The only way you can actually get properly flat omelets. You try and use a three-dimensional egg for a pancake or anything like that, or baking, you just into something that looks weird. And what you want is a two-dimensional egg. So we've got some free roaming chickens. We've got snow. Let's see a few more mushrooms. So that's quite the Tiaga forest. And a pine forest surrounding this modest hills biome. That looks like some kind of pretty extreme hills over there that we're looking at later. Depending on how far this little Minecraft event goes, but 
Respawned in pretty much over here, so this looks like a hard decent spot to build a home. Oh, you're making messy noises over there. Yeah, grumpy noises, I'm afraid. No, oh, I dug too deep. I don't think I have enough of what I need to make anything nice. I need to shear some sheep before I can actually make a bed. But I can keep repeatedly hitting the wrong button for adventuring. It's not what you wanted to put, right? It doesn't have to be a small or particularly interesting thing we're doing. It is literally just a bunker to spend the night in. I might make a door. That's this. There we go. Three spruce doors, apparently. I will grab that, that, that. Two sets of torches. I will grab my quick bar. If you not have the eggs, I will have the door. Light, light, light. Door. Corner piece. There we go. Somewhere with which I can... Uh, there's the nasty wings and there's a spider. Yes, I see you looking at me. I can see it looking at me. There's a skeleton. Uh, spider just depopped. <laughs> Fine, you, you, you do that. You vanish into the night. I am blatantly not going down there with a bow and arrow. I'm assuming you can shear the llamas. But anyway, there's my little bolt hole. Literally a hole I can bolt into. Is that a llama? No, that's a skeleton. Despite the fact that I'm highly illuminated, it has not seen me. Total lack of anything approaching armour. Oh. Oh, just how crap is this wooden sword? Hey, that didn't take very long, did it, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> Slain by a zombie. All right, so did I get my positioning right where my uh, I did my stem starters over there. All right. Apparently I just got the achievement Cow Tipper. I don't quite know how I managed to get the achievement Cow Tipper, but apparently I successfully tipped the cow. And some bones. Right. Apparently spinning is a thing you can do. I am circle strafing the zombie. This is going better than it with a skeleton, because that thing can hit me from range. <laughs> Running away! So my first night's not going too well, I've died once already. Uh, more of them. Ow. I kind of think of it as, you know, some kind of hole or something to hide on might have been a better idea. Yeah, the problem is with going into my hole is that I'm pretty sure that these days they will knock the door down. Alright. Alright. 
So in between episodes, I'm going to look up how you eat things. Because I've apparently forgotten. Well, I suppose while I'm here, I don't have enough stone to make a thing. Um, let's do a quick inventory reorganize. Apparently, I did... Oh, no, no, there's my axe. Yes. It sounds like llama pain going on out there. They're not beating down at all, which is good. Um, in the interim, dig, 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 grab. Inventory. Do I have a bit of earth? I do. Cut the hole. Now I have a stone sword. I'm assuming this will be slightly better. Oh, one of them's hanging. And a creeper. What fun. Well, it wouldn't be Minecraft if it didn't involve deep, deep, deep unpleasant doom. Will you hurry up and go off? Alright, well, there's a the first creeper kill. And it turns out this, one of the major problems we had was the fact that that was a really shitty sword. Or the dingy noises. The cave. It is a cave. I apparently have got the brightness up a bit high, so it's not actually that dark down here. Doesn't bother me. It watches a creeper land on my head. It will happen, of course. Alright, okay. There are quite a few of you around, and I am slowly beginning to heal. Right. Okay. So, one of the other things I need is a furnace. Before that, I need to get some metal. I should make sure I avoid pickaxing the llama. I'm pretty sure the llamas will appreciate being pickaxed. I see you, creepery fiends. I see you. I want this door back. Thank you for giving me my door back. Alright. Step pyramid arrangement. No, that's the wrong place. Look, Mr. Llama, go that way. We have no desire for my llama there. I am alarmed by the llama. The llama has alarmed me. on this side, I think. Zombie meat. Well, I think I can eat that, though it does poison me. Look, you spitting fiend. Go away. I'm trying to build a bunker or a house here. <laughs> at least attempting to. I'm going to have to just slaughter you, aren't I? Wee! <laughs> no, apparently, decided that it needs to drop me off down here now, because wherever I was previously spawning is no longer viable. So, at least as long as I get dropped at the bottom of the hill. Well, there's my door. <laughs> um, there's my axe. I think that probably dealt with the llama. Apparently that was a little bit of fall damage. Uh, 
That didn't do surprising as much damage as I would have thought it done sure. to um, my little house. It did, however, solve my llama problem at the cost of, you know, my brains being liberally scattered across the landscape. Me, it's my little bit of experience. Alright, and my eggs. Alright, so that happened. <laughs> nice. Kind of, you don't really have Minecraft, you know, without proper explosions at various points. Wouldn't be Minecraft without a creeper. So now I need to go back to fixing the holes that have been merrily been blown in my landscape. Since I had more of those bricks versus that probably they've been blown up. Oh, I've got three doors, that's why. Yes, I hear you grumbling. There's more noises in the background as always. Right. There we go. And there we have a hole. To quickly sort of that, which I will do between episodes. Thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I am the Marmoset. This is the Minecraft. We are just prattling around a little bit while we wait for other games to get interesting and all get set up. Bye for now.